Good morning. Here we are in Key Colony Beach with sun shining, thank goodness. And we are ready for our ninth annual kids fishing derby. Our day starts off at 7.30. You can see they're starting to line up and get in there to register. We register all the children at around 9.15. We'll have them over at the Marathon Lady. That's the boat we're going on today. We started this back eight years ago. And our idea was to have these kids go out and get on a one boat, go out and go fishing. And we wanted it to be a no cost to the children. And we wanted every kid to walk away with something. Um, the knowledge of fishing, um, something that they can take back and say that they were part of, of this event. We do have nine places for uh, trophies. We have uh, certain class, classes of age groups. We have six to eight year olds, and then we have a first, second, and third place trophy for them. We have nine to 11 year olds, and then a first, second, and place for them. And then we have the 12 to 14 year olds. So we get a, a wide variety of ages on this derby. Um, this derby is sponsored by the members in the community, the businesses, the organizations, all donations. Uh, that's where all our money comes from. Some of the organizers this year will be Bill Nickman from the Fishing and Boating Club. We have Peter Hines from the Fishing and Boating Club. We have Vice Mayor Ron Sutton, and we also have Commissioner Ed Wovis. Uh, so this year is very well organized with a lot of good folks behind getting this derby going for this ninth year. If you look around the room, everyone wearing a yellow shirt, they're a volunteer. See all our volunteers? And any volunteers that don't have a yellow shirt, we need to get you one. The volunteer's job is to help all the kids, okay? So if anybody has a question, a yellow shirt, ask them, okay? I'll be out there also. I'll have the green shirt here. You can ask me for help. I have four gentlemen over there with red shirts. Those are our judges. I'll announce them now of who you need to go to when you catch a fish so we can measure it, okay? If you have any questions, just ask any yellow shirts or any red shirt, and we'll direct you in the right place. We'll go out there, we'll do some fishing, we're gonna catch a lot of fish, we're coming back in, and we go to the inn for lunch. Everybody good with that? Yeah. We're gonna have a good time? Yeah! All right! Marathon Lady takes us out from 9.30 to about 1.30, we're about a mile offshore. All the kids do their fishing and it, it doesn't go into certain classes of fish, but the sizes of fish. We don't take anything that's dangerous on board, like sharks or anything like that. And then basically lays on a ruler and whichever the big fish is, they'll be the, one of their winners in their class per age. Don't go anywhere. The ninth annual Key Colony Beach Kids Fishing Derby will be back after these messages. Lionfish may be beautiful to look at, but they are a danger, not only to the waters of the Keys, but to humans as well. Never try to pick up a lionfish or remove one from the hook, as their spines are toxic. Only someone with proper knowledge should ever attempt to handle the lionfish. Hi, and I hope that you've been enjoying the show. I am thrilled to be here in Marathon in the Florida Keys on Marathon Florida TV channel 88 and MarathonFlorida.com. This is the premier Marathon TV station where you're gonna find out about all the greatest things about this wonderful community and its great people, food, dining, live music, water activities, everything that's going on right here, this channel is bringing together this amazing community and telling the stories of all of the wonderful things that are going on right here. But it takes a lot to put this station together. We're talking 24-hour programming to capture 
everything that's going on here. It takes a lot to put this station together and we really need all of your help. And there's many ways that you can participate. You can go to MarathonFlorida.com and like our social media pages and give us some feedback and share your ideas about some of the programming you'd like to see right here. Or you can take it up to another level and become an advertiser with our station because we need to find out what's going on in your business and in your backyard. This is where you want to share all of your wonderful news and all of the wonderful things that you have to offer in your business. So go to our website, give us a call, find out how you can be a part of Marathon Florida TV channel 88, marathonflorida.com, because it really does take a community to bring this entire thing together and show the world why this is the best place to be in Florida. When boating, please take your garbage back with you and dispose it properly on the land. County Fishing Club, the big boys, they really whine.
are watching the 9th Annual Key Colony Beach Kids Fishing Derby. More fun is coming up next. Sombrero Reef got its name from the Sombrero Lighthouse and comes from the Spanish Keo Sombrero or Key Hat. There is always something going on in the Keys. Check our website for events and activities near you. Welcome back. We hope that you've been enjoying this wonderful show. All of us here at Marathon Florida TV, Channel 88, are working really hard to bring you the best that Marathon and the Florida Keys has to offer. But it takes a lot of work to bring a station like this together, and we need everyone's help in the community to pull this off and make this the premier station right here in Marathon Florida, Channel 88. We are looking for a variety of people to give us great ideas of what they would like to see right here on this station. This is Marathon's premier station, this is your station, and we want to know what's on your mind. We need producers, we need great show ideas, but most of all, we need advertisers because it's the advertisers that really allow us to bring our message home and it really allows us to bring you some great programming and to capture all of the wonderful things that we can offer right here in Marathon in the Florida Keys. We are looking for people that would like to contribute and not just with their business ideas and their show ideas, but also in any way that they can to advertise things that they have going on because we want to know, we care about what's going on right here in your business at Channel 88. Please use caution when visiting the reefs. Your accident can be their disaster. Throughout the Keys, many decommissioned ships have been purposely sunk to create artificial reefs for the sea life to live in. Come back around 1.30, get them bussed over here to the Key Colony Inn. The Key Colony Inn hosts the event every year. Uh, they've been gracious with us doing that. Gonzales Landscaping supplies all the food and the drinks. And we have uh, free hot dogs and hamburgers for all the children, for their parents that would also like to come to the event for any awards. And they also have all the sponsors we invite to be there. When we're there at the inn and the children start eating lunch, they do get some door prizes. Uh, they have raffle tickets, they can win all sorts of kind of prizes from fishing rods to lunch boxes, all, all, just all sorts of stuff and many of those are also donated by our sponsors. Around 2 o'clock um, once that's going on and that's done when we go ahead and, and announce the trophy winners and the children get to see and, and they don't know until we get to the end if they're a winner or not so they're all anticipating that they're the winner and um, their stories will tell you they are all the winners which is a great great event. Um, then we have a photo, uh, a photo op there with them so the kids can have their pictures and we then send those out to the newspapers and we hope that they get printed so the kids can say uh, that they were part of something and they have something they can put on their wall with their trophies. And it's been a great success and this year I think it's going to be even better. Okay, can I have your attention please? We get started with our program. How is that food? Food was sponsored by Gonzalez Landscaping, so make sure we thank them. I want to welcome everyone to the 9th Annual Kids Fishing Derby. Let's hear it. Everyone did a great job. We had 38 anglers out there. We had 17 on our volunteer list, and everyone did a great job. So again, thank you all for making it such a pleasurable trip. And everybody came back safe. That's the best part. What I also like to do is when you have a chance, the back of your shirt mimics the, this sponsor banner. Please, take time when you see these folks to say thank you. Because without them, we couldn't do this every year, okay? 
And a special thanks to the key colony, the key colony in here. Sergey does this for absolutely free and helps us out. And the fishing club also, this year is a big part of the fishing derby, helping this get going. So thank everyone you see that was a sponsor. The Commodore of the Fishing and Boating Club, Bill Nickman. A little history about the Derby for those who don't know. We started this again nine years ago. We wanted to get something out here. The kids could get involved in. The police department got involved in. We want the kids to see us as someone they can turn to and not turn away from. So we wanted to make sure you all understand we're there to help you. We also wanted to get all our anglers at an early age to turn around to be customers to some of these, the head boats that we take out. The next time you see Marathon Lady or you want to go fishing, that's a good place to start because they did a great job. All their mates were wonderful. So thank them next time you see them also, please. This helps us for next year. It helps us keep it coming for next year. What we're going to do now is we're going to go over some sponsors. Uh, again, these are folks that donated to make this derby happen. It's Ed McGraw here. Ed McGraw's daughter. Ron and Kitty Sutton. We can't sum up all their help in a clock, so we do thank them for all their hard work. Kelly Electric. Kelly Electric. Christian Landscaping, Savannah Breezes, Centennial Bank, Garbage. We want to take time now to say a special thank you to co-chairman Ed Wovis and Peter Hines. We did a lot of good work on this journey and get a lot of the donations for one other presentation we'd like to make. This young man was on the boat last year. He was fishing on his own dime. He saw we had our derby and saw some of the kids were having a tough time catching some fish. He started taking them and helping them catch up, catch fish. He came with us this year as part of our derby to help. I want to thank, take a special thank you for Aiden Dandoff. That's all of our sponsors. The trophy winners of the ninth annual Key Colony Beach Fishing Derby are coming up next. You don't want to miss this one. Marathon began its life as a base camp for the railroad workers. It is said they gave Marathon its name after their own endurance. Hope you've been enjoying the show. Welcome back, I'm Angela. We're reporting from right here in Marathon in the Florida Keys. This is Marathon Florida TV, channel 88, and MarathonFlorida.com. And it takes a lot of hard work to bring shows 
together in this amazing station right here in Marathon. And when I first found out about it, I knew I wanted to be involved. And I became a producer, and I'm going to be producing shows right here on this channel, Channel 88, and I couldn't be more thrilled. However, I need your help. We all need your help. And there's three different things that you can do. You can be a fan of our wonderful shows here and support our local talent and all of the wonderful programming that they're bringing to you. Or feel free to be a sponsor of one of our shows. There's many, many ways. You could just call the number on your screen to find out amazing sponsorship opportunities of how you can get involved and get highlighted right on one of our shows and also on our website. Or you could also be an advertiser and buy one of our fabulous spots during one of our amazing shows right here on Channel 88, Marathon Florida TV, because we'd be thrilled to have you. This is your chance to show the community the amazing business that you have and to highlight all of the wonderful things that you're offering our Marathon community. So please go on our website, find out how you can get involved. You can be a fan, you can be a sponsor, you can be an advertiser. All the information will be on our website or on this or on the phone number right here on our screen. So feel free to reach out and stay tuned because we're bringing you some great stuff. Again, I'm Angela and please keep a lookout for me and my show that I'm really excited about to bring you right here on Marathon Florida TV. And don't hesitate to reach out to us and find out how you can get involved because this is a community effort and we need your help. Thank you for watching and stay tuned. Remember the rules of fishing. Take only in season and only the limit. So we're starting with the six to eight year olds. And for third place in the six to eight year old category, Giovanni. San Martin. Yay! And in second place, six to eight year olds, Billy Martin. Yay! And in first place, six to eight year olds, Lucas Silva. Second place trophy, sponsored by Key Colony Beach Realty. I had nothing to do with the judging on this. Jasmine DiGiovanni. <laughs> and we have the 9 to 11 category. Our first place winner trophy, sponsored by Christian Landscaping. Hannah. Ostrich. Her third place winner, the trophy was sponsored by Florida Keys Air Conditioning. For the third place winner, Sergio Borchevis. The second place trophy winner, 12 to 14 year olds. Kaylee McGraw. And our first place winner, ages 12 to 14, Ben Ryder. At this time, I would like to invite Mayor, our Mayor Kikani Beach. Mayor Geraldine Zahn to say a few words. Thank you very much. First of all, I think most important, I'd like to thank all of these wonderful young people that came today. You did a good job fishing, and you here has been wonderful, and I hope you enjoy all the wonderful prizes and gifts. And remember, next year we'll be here again, so we'll be looking for you. Don't forget to sign up early so you're sure you get in. Hi, this is Bill Nickman from the Commodore of the Key County Beach Fishing and Boating Club. I just want to say that we had a wonderful day today. I want to thank all our sponsors who made this thing possible. Uh, we had a, God bless us, with a beautiful, beautiful day. After a threat of rain, everything turned out great. 
All the kids had a wonderful time and the sponsors and the volunteers. And we just like to say, we're going to do this every year. Just get in early because it fills up very quickly and we hate to disappoint any children. And I just wanted to thank everybody on our committee uh, with the City of Key County, City of Marathon and the Boating and Fishing Club for a great job. All these people worked very, very hard. And I, I'd like to say we had over 56 sponsors throughout the City of Key County and Marathon that made donations to this great cause and I want to thank them all and ask everybody to support uh, all these wonderful sponsors that are on our, our bulletin board and we'll have more coming in a, a, a newspaper edition that'll come out shortly. So thank you very much and have a great day.